Today, we want to show a tutorial about how to use command line commands in Jupyter Notebook for data scientists. Consequently, this is also very useful for Udacity students working in their project workspace. This is, is a Udacity project workspace. It will mimic what we're trying to do. Here you can see there is an import visual as VS. There are two ways that we can view this local file. Some of the other imports are obviously commonly used libraries, but this one happened to be local. So if you click on open, you will be able to see this visuals.py that we imported, be able to inspect the code and understand how the code runs. Click the Jupyter icon to go back to your notebook menu and then click on the green icon that is your cur current running notebook. You can also view this file really nicely in the command line. Whenever you want to run a command line command, use the exclamation mark. You can do ls to list every file in the directory can use cat name of the script to view the details of the script. Be able to scroll down. And let's say we want to view a function such as distribution. What we can do is use pipe and grep, which will search for this particular word and get an idea where things are from or easier to work with is use command f or control f and search for the same word in this way you get a GUI way to view the file so remember that you can run almost um quite a few command line commands using the exclamation mark